This low pressure system boat, it's going to be tough, man. They're going to they're going to be locked up. We're fishing a two-man team, which we're getting the job done so far. We have a 40 in the boat, but we find that it's much easier with the three-man team. One to fight the fish, one to drive the boat, and one to gaff the fish. So it's a little disadvantage right now for us with a two-man team, but we're making it happen. You know, normally I like to fish the warmer water in most areas. This place is so different up here, though. I, it's Yesterday was the first time we ever fished up here, and, and trying to adapt so quickly. Beach fishing is something we're never really used to doing down in Key West. We use ribbon fish, and I hate those things. They're, they're the ugliest looking baits I've ever seen, but uh, we really like to use blue runners down our, our way. I think that the fisheries change, but the dynamics of a kingfish, I just I love to have that live bait where he gets nervous when the fish sees him. Slow it down just a tad, Bill. We got a nervous bait. He's nervous. There you go. Get the wheel, Bill. Probably a school level. Uh, Talk about that two-man team stuff. There we go. Two-man <laughs> team. Where's Mikey when you need him? For our boat, I think three people in the boat is is perfect for us. We're not crowded. Uh, no one. Everyone has their job. Not having Mike in the boat on this tournament probably hurt us a little bit by not getting everything done that we needed to. Good tape. Big lazy pig. I cranked up the drag on this one. I'm confident it's not a kingfish, but what do I know? I run in the three rods, it makes it a lot easier for a two-man team. We still have a rod fishing. We're fighting two fish. We don't know if they're kingfish at this time. They never made their run to say I'm a kingfish. But this allows us to fish one more rod, three rods. We can fight two, and we're still fishing for a big fish. Two flat lines is what we usually are running in, down in Key West, uh, depending on the situation. But uh, up here, we don't normally use downriggers a lot. goes. We like to carry this D hooker with us, try to get the hooks out of the fish that we're not going to keep. Makes it that much better for the fish. And also the length of this D hooker keeps our fingers away from kingfish when we get into them. Big jack up here. 